Somehow new car prices are still out of control. So as always, we're gonna be guessing how much dealerships are actually asking for their cars. We got two special guests today, Alanis and Elizabeth. Nolan's over there on the side. I'm Jeremiah, welcome to Donut. $200,000. What? 200 grand? Asking price, they're not gonna get that. Big thanks to carparts.com for sponsoring today's video. Someone or something has been sneaking into the garage and working on the cars late at night. I'm about to find out who. Man, it is creepy in here at night. Something smells weird too. Oh, what the, are you, are you a vampire? I am Garrett, the Lord Dracula of Donutvania. Thanks to carparts.com and their new lifetime replacement guarantee on parts they sell, it's worth it for an immortal soul to work on cars again. I just buy a part from carparts.com, then when the life force is fully sucked out of it, I buy a replacement from carparts.com and send back the used one for a refund. For the lifetime of the vehicle, a lifetime! The competition's 30-day guarantee just pales in comparison. <laughs> well, you would know about being pale. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just kidding, man. I'm kidding. Ah! Visit carparts.com today and save up to 50% off compared to other parts stores and local dealers. Get the right parts right now with a lifetime replacement guarantee. Just click the link below. I'm just saying, I historically have had a very poor record on this show. I picked Nolan to not hurt his feelings and he didn't bother to tell me this until we sat at the table. <laughs> you got the pity pick, Nolan. Adversaries all around me. I have no expectations for myself. We're gonna do it, we're just gonna have fun. I've definitely heard of cars before, so I think we're gonna do fine. Our first car is a 2022 Ford Ranger XLT being sold in Sacramento, California. It's got the 2.3 liter EcoBoost and the FX4 off-road package. MSRP for this vehicle is $43,295. As always, we're playing prices right rules. Yes. So All right. you go over, Stun. you bust. I'm thinking this car's like 15K over. I was gonna say, I'm thinking 15. I was thinking like 60. I feel like 60 is a good. Yeah, that's a good guess. Yeah. We're gonna go with 60K. 60. We got this. Yeah. Boom. Lock it in, Max. What do you guys think? Okay. It's silver. It's silver. This is gonna be a buyer that, for some reason, didn't choose a Tacoma TRD off-road. I have no idea reason. why. Still has the goodies, though. Still has what you want if you're overlanding or whatever. I'm in the like 52 to 56 range here. Yeah, let's just call it 55. Yeah, but if we go over, then do we both lose? We both lose. Then we should go 52. Go lower. Okay, 52. 52. Trying to game us. Oh, like Jerry's never gamed this game. <laughs> the Ranger was actually listed for $83,000. <laughs> It's not even, it's not even the Tremor. It's not the Raptor. It's the first vehicle, 83 grand? It's still for sale, no kidding. Yeah, not surprised, fuckers. <laughs> the next vehicle is a 2022 Kia EV6 GT, listed in Grand Junction, Colorado. The GT means it has about 320 horsepower, it is all wheel drive, and MSRP should be $59,000. I feel like Colorado is a high, high price community. See, that's, that's, where it is is really exactly. important too. I wouldn't be surprised if this were ninety thousand dollars. I'd go with eighty. I'd you want to go eighty? Okay, let's go eighty. We're locking in at eighty thousand dollars. I think they went too conservative. I totally bungled the last one. So whatever <laughs> reasoning you want to do. Like these people are going to be interested in this car. It's new and fancy and great. You're making fun of me, and I don't like that. Should we just go eighty-one? Price, Price is right. right. Look, if he always wins, we have to yeah, game him. Yeah, we gotta him. play Jerry's game. You All right, eighty-one. Eighty-one. Kia EV6 was listed for. $73,000. You're close. The markup can't be too high for these cars because once you start going too high, then you're getting into territory of other EVs that are- Nolan, why didn't you say that three minutes ago? No wonder you always lose. <laughs> Our next vehicle is a 2022 Cadillac CT4V Blackwing sold in Cathedral City, California. And this has a 472 horsepower twin turbo V6 with a manual transmission. MSRP, $79,345. I think this is $100,000. I was gonna say, I can see it's going for six digits. Yeah, because they're gonna just try to screw up Absolutely. dollar over garbage. Absolutely we just gotta hit it right on the money. Let's do one of those. Uh -huh. 
103. <laughs> $103,000. Lock it in, Max. 103. Nolan? I'm saying 125. 112, Nolan. Don't get so excited. 112. 112. 112. The dealer is asking $119,000. See? There's no way that they get that much for it. No, no. absolutely not. They're gonna point? get that much for it. You think so? Oh yeah. Okay, here we go, we got a fun fact. In New York City, dealers were ordered to pay $800,000 in penalties and restitution for adding markups above their advertised prices. Being greedy ain't illegal, but lying about your prices is considered false advertising. Good. 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 Every state should do that. Now it's actually been incredibly hard to find vehicles for this video because since our last video like this, dealers have actually started hiding their prices online. Oh, well, we're going after you, <laughs> you're next. Who's the first two guys? What were their dealership? Oh, well, never mind. Like a lower third, like dealer name, town. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I want the photo of their family on the mantle. Our next vehicle is a 2022 Subaru WRX sold in Orlando, Florida. MSRP, $38,455. Is someone really paying above MSRP for all that cladding? Yeah, you have to save some money for the wrap that you're gonna Yeah, get save that. some money for the wrap. Haters um, over here, dude. Are you not a cladding hater? You know what, Nolan? I think that's a beautiful car. So we go first. We go first. I say 49. 49 seems like a WRX price. Okay, here's what I'm thinking. Yeah. All right, we've already had three in a row that were just like crushers. Like I think Max throws in one of these every now and then where it's like, sometimes there's always one good dealer out there and we highlight them. In Orlando? <laughs> <laughs> Everything I just said, throw it out the window. Let's do 51. Okay. I'm gonna die on this hill. It's okay. It wrong. Let's go 51, Max. The dealer asking price for the Subaru is $37,454. See, I knew it, Max. I knew it. I knew this was gonna be the one that was right in between. Moving on to our next car, a 2022 Toyota Supra A91 CF Edition, which is one of 600 with this trim, it has carbon fiber accents, MSRP $58,815. Max says it's a six-cylinder car. This is, is this a GR? Can you tell us if that's different than the, than the GR one? Can you use it in a sentence? Hold on, what the hell is this? The CF is technically an exclusive GR Supra. Okay, thank you, I just wanted to dude. clarify. I know, but if I already know it, then, then, then I'm at a disadvantage because he's giving you more information. So you're at an advantage because you're smarter. That's the whole point. And like you knew that. I did, Nolan. Bullshit. I'm trusting Nolan here. Okay, we, are, we are going with God. 85. First of all, you guys are way wrong. This is a $100,000 car. But I'm going to game you guys. So $85,000 in one penny. The actual asking price for the Supra, $81,000. <laughs> Yeah. This is bad. <laughs> By the way, guys, speaking of cars, uh, you guys have a new podcast coming out, yeah? Donut Racing Show. It's our new podcast about Formula One. We're not F1 professionals, but we do love talking about the show. If you're new to Formula One as well, if you're a big Drive to Survive fan, big casual fan, you'll love our show. Check it out wherever you get your podcast, Donut Racing Show, DRS. Up next from South Bend, Indiana, a 2022 Ford Mustang Mach-E. This is the premium trim, but it is not the GT. MSRP, $58,815. This feels like a 70 or 80 to me. I think you're in the right, uh, <laughs> Do people drive EVs in South Bend, Indiana? Well, there's probably a lot of EVs in Chicago. <laughs> Should we go 72? Yeah. 72. <laughs> There are so many noises coming from this table. <laughs> so my girlfriend went to put money down on a uh, EV to buy the car was a minimum 15K over MSRP. I think it's more than 14K over I asking, more than don't 14K. you? 75. Go 75? 75. 75. Let's go 75. The Mustang Mach E asking price is $73,815. No! <laughs> So close. This is where we should have played a penny. I'm done being civil. It's over. I'm playing dirty now. <laughs> Up next is a 2023 Chevrolet Corvette Stingray 2LT sold in Long Beach, California. This has a 6.2 liter V8 loaded accessories. MSRP, $71,500. Corvette boy seems like he'd pay 91 for this. I think more. Honestly, I feel like it's almost like 120. 91. Alright, 91, fine. 91. Don't just get browbeat over here. <laughs>
We're doing the penny again. It has Wait, to be. You're doing the penny? Yeah, more than 91. Right? I was gonna pay more than 91. I almost bought a 2022 instead of buying a house. That's I'd good. go with 91.1. Okay, 91.1. The Corvette asking price is $117,000. Oh, <laughs> look at that. You were gonna say 120, we would lose anyway. I know, you should just talk me down 5,000 and we'd be okay. <laughs> Another fun fact, Chevrolet just sent an email to people on the Z06 waiting list incentivizing keeping their car and not flipping it. They'll receive 500,000 Chevy points, which you can oh, use. That's like Cole's cash. Yeah. You can use for accessories on the online Chevy store. Like a little plastic spider ring or a, a, a gummy worm. Uh, or 5,000 real dollars wow. if they keep their Z06 for at least 12 months and don't flip it in that time. But also you could definitely make way more than five grand flipping. if you're flipping it. Yeah, we do this. <laughs> All right, this next one is a 2022 BMW M4 Competition X-Drive Coupe out of Spokane, Washington. It is a used car, it's got 10,000 miles on the odometer, but it has a special order individual paint option worth $2,000. MSRP, $84,650. All wheel drive, but What's it's also got- What's the interior? Got... Is it the lime green and blue interior? Or... Looks like black, if this is the actual car. I also have an important question. Can you tell me how much the dealer is asking for it? <laughs> <laughs> used cars are extra spicy. That's what I'm saying. Oh. It's probably a couple Gs more. Hard 90. Or 90? Or 90. I don't know, I think we're six figures. I think we're like 104. Nolan, what do you think? And then go 5K less. Let's do 100. Well, minus five is 99. All right, 99. The BMW had an asking price of $200,000. <laughs> what? 200 grand? Asking price, they're not gonna get that. They should take money away from if anyone buys that. Max, cut the with these ones, okay? That's insane. I would rather get kidnapped in the trunk of one of those than pay $200,000 for it. I would pay $200,000 uh, to not get kidnapped. <laughs> As someone who's been kidnapped, it's never who you want it to be. <laughs> Our next vehicle is a 2022 Jeep Gladiator out of Hollywood, California. It has a very rare Gobi paint color. MSRP for this vehicle is $47,750. Is it just, it's just the paint is rare? It's not like a Rubicon package or anything like that? So the MSRP is 47, 74. Reverse the numbers. If I'm a dealer and I'm just screwing with people, I switch to 74. Can I get you down to 65? This is like an actual conversation at a dealership. Come on, I can't do 74, but would you take 75? And you guys are on a team. <laughs> 65, whatever. 65, thank you. 65. It's, a, it's hard because Jeep people are crazy. That's what I'm saying. They were going for 15 over before this all started. Oh. Let's do a dollar over. You want to do a dollar Let's over? Let's do a dollar over. You don't think I'm it's under? Be... I'm thinking of the game here, uh -huh. you know? Yeah. Max has got to bring us down back to reality. But also, if I mess up, I'm going to f***ing lose my mind. <laughs> <laughs> a dollar over. Let's do it. A dollar of what they said. <laughs> okay. Whoa! <laughs> Asking price for the Gladiator, $83,989. Oh, yes. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Oh man, I would've gone bananas if I did a dollar. Oh, oh, hey, hey, what's up? Oh, okay, yeah, come up here. Hey. Hey guys, how's it going? I'm Jeremiah, and we also sell kids shirts now. This is uh, my little uh, friend. <laughs> this is my little friend Jarvis, and Jarvis is our model for our new donut kids tees. You can go get yours right now at donutmedia.com. Donut tees for, for the little ones. Look at this. Yeah? Okay. Okay. All right, I love you too. All right, bye. Our final vehicle is a 2021 Nissan GTR T-Spec. The T-Spec trim means it has a limited edition midnight purple colorway. It's got Nismo forged wheels, wider front fenders, and a carbon fiber spoiler. It came with an MSRP of $140,285. John, where are these scumbags? Okay, well, you're close to Miami, so yeah, just think about like, Miami prices. Okay, can I have a private conversation? So no! These suckers can't hear. <laughs> Because really I kind of want to end on something that's like super high. That's right? what I was yeah. kind of thinking of. Yeah. Okay, two hundred fifty thousand dollars. Yeah, suck on that. <laughs> okay, so they went super high. 
It's midnight purple. That's like, that's a really special color though. I think someone would be willing to pay that much. But it's Miami, it's Florida, and people are crazy. They probably, they probably already have like a midnight purple jet ski that they're trying to match. They probably are asking some ridiculous price. 350,000. <laughs> Nolan, is, this is all you. Totally your call, Nolan. Balls in your court, you'd never beat me. You'd never beat me, Nolan. You'll have to live with this for the rest of your life. <laughs> It has to be a ridiculous price because it's sat there for so long. It's a 2021, it's not even this model year. It's in Florida, near Miami. People have tons of money to waste. I'm gonna say $250,000. God dang it, no! No! One cent! No. The asking price of the GTR for ultimate victory of this game, $430,000. No! In your face, Gary! I finally won! I finally won, Jerry. I beat you. Yeah. That's I mean, upsetting. that's why it's still there. I know. That's why it's still sitting there. Yeah. Midnight purple, though. Nice color. Right, Jimmy? Midnight purple. Hey! Thank you guys so much for watching this episode and everything else at Donut. Hit that like and subscribe button. Also, don't forget to listen to the Donut Racing Show with these three lovely people. Until next time. Like we wanted to hire a kid, but we couldn't. So we got a mannequin and we put a shirt on a mannequin. This is so creepy, Max. <laughs>